Yes, guys, welcome back to another episode of the Good Enough Podcast. We've been missing for the past. I two thought weeks. you was gonna say we're here every Wednesday. Nah, nah. Nah. <laughs> We've been missing for the past two weeks. We know what well, would have been three weeks now. Well, we're uploading this week, but yeah, yeah, man, it's not even due to laziness, and that ain't like just a cop out. But genuinely, it, it, it actually is, ain't. We're both just busy, and this the, this studio is in fucking East London, so it's on the other side from us. And it's, it's like an hour and a bit here, hour and a bit back. So when we're trying to schedule our days, sometimes he's busy, sometimes I'm busy. They weren't aligning, man. They weren't That's aligning. A, we'll just take care of that. Uh, uh, we're back now. We're here. Yeah. <laughs> take that with a pinch of salt. Sorry. But, innit? <clears throat> but yeah. Um, you know what's been bugging me recently? Mm. I feel like I'm so addicted to my phone at the minute. Same. Like, okay. like, like, like I used to be all right now. I'm... How about this? How about this? Go on your settings right now. Check your screen, screen time. time. I don't yeah. think mine's that deep compared to other people. I think my screen time is going to be more than yours. I think it will. I, I, I consciously make the effort to not go on my phone. Uh, Shall I tell you mine? Go on. My daily average is six hours and 29 minutes. Mine's four hours and 13. That's really low. That's good. Yeah, but I feel like I'm... Mm. My, no, but to, my, my, oh yeah, my, 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 mate, my mates is 11 hours. No, that's horrible. Swear down. Does he just leave it on on the side or side? No, no, he's just on it. But I think, bro, if I'm on it four hours, you must never see the light of day. Can't do that. Can't do that. But here's the thing. Mine's a 20% <coughs> increase from last week. No, 20% decrease from last week, sorry. What's mine? Mine's a 20% decrease from last week as well. <laughs> so that, that, means, just... that means we're going down. That means we're going down. So I picked that... up my phone on a daily average 197 times. Where does it say that? You scroll down. So you see we got Daily these. average, I picked up my phone. My most pickups are Wednesday, 274. Daily average, 193. My most used app is Snapchat. I knew you was going to say that. You Because all my group yeah, chats, group chats yeah. Mine's WhatsApp, obviously. Then Insta, then Snap. My Snap, Insta, WhatsApp. Then MetaTrader. Oh, come on. <laughs> come on now. I mean, got me putting nah, the trades on, mine's notes. Come on, because you know I'm writing the lyrics. <laughs> yeah. The, the occupation's fourth. <laughs> the occupation's fourth in the fucking... The occupation? What's that? The occupation, the job's fourth. So you do the trading Oh, yeah, you're trading. Fourth. Yeah, mine's yeah. notes. Yeah, well, no, because you don't need to be on MetaTrader all the time. The True. analysis on trading. Notification. Whether not. <sighs> all right, so look. Could you, for example, live without your phone? I say... Let's know. Let's put a time period on it, because... We don't want to say get rid of it forever. Bro, I wish I could, but it's like, it's my job. I need to be on my phone. Right, cool. So let's take like, that out. I get anxiety. Like sometimes I'll, I, I I haven't done it that well this year, but definitely last year I was very good at once a day, leave my phone, take my other phone where it's only got emails, yeah, you work did that. stuff I on remember there you did and going on a walk or going mm -hmm. gym with that. So I'm not distracted. At the minute I've left all my group chats. I always go through these fucking stages, stages where I'm really becoming a bum. And thinking, I don't like how I am. Need to I fix am. up. Yeah, Need yeah. to fix up. Leave on my group chats. Go total fucking. Because yeah. then I'm not distracted. Because my biggest distraction is just going to group chats and talking to my pals. Right, I don't care yeah. what people do on Insta. I yeah. don't care about everyone's, everyone's life. Everyone's I'm not really yeah. like that. But yeah. like, like, it's more just what everyone that I know is doing. Mm. And like, it's just fucking wasting time. And I just. If I, if I leave my phone even upstairs now and I go downstairs, I get anxiety because I think someone's going to message me that's important about work because where I run a business off my phone, yeah. especially ever since the trading stuff, like yeah, I need to be, be active constantly. because I'm running a chat. I, yeah. I need to be on it. Do you know what I mean? When, when, when a signal, when a, when a trade's about to fucking yeah, you got be valid. You got responsibilities. <laughs> Let's say we took that out of it, yeah? And it wasn't, none of that stuff was the case. No yeah. job. That wasn't, that wasn't your job. Could you leave your phone on? Yeah. You could. I reckon yeah. you could. No, I could, I could, I could. Yeah, I don't think you give a shit. It's like sometimes when we go on holiday and that, I'm barely you're on barely it. on your phone. Yeah, yeah, you couldn't. You, I feel like you. Could I do like it. not being on my my phone, bro. Yeah. It makes me feel like my head. Sometimes when you're on your phone too much, your head is just when you're on TikTok, bro. It's like no, a but brain that's a rock. brain killer, though, bro. That's that, that's that's just. Oh. That's a brain. Do you know? Have you ever sit in bed and just go through TikTok all the time, right? Well, I think norm normally normally we'll do that. Shit. Yeah, <laughs> genuinely, <laughs> mine. After about 10 minutes, I can feel my brain dying. Yeah, bro. word. It's like, uh, imagine these little kids. This is what I'm saying. Young. No, they, can't, they, they spawned in when TikTok was a thing. And they, they must be fucking up. Their attention span, their patience. My patience recently, over the past year, has got so bad. Like, so bad. Like, it's annoying. It's probably because now, though, we live in a fast food world, bro. Like, everything's everything's short form. Everything's quick. Everything's but it's annoying. Quick. 
That's, I'm really impatient. Like I was always impatient, but now I'm really impatient. I hear it. I start getting fucking aggravated if something like, I, like to the point where, I don't know, I'll be in the gym, for example. Yeah. Someone's in the machine. Someone's, I'm about to walk over, someone's in the machine. I'll brush the machine and just go to the next one and then not even do it. Just not do the act. Just work. not do it. Not do the On odd occasion or like something, something similar to that where I need to do something. But if there's a one minor distraction, I can't, I can't make it. I can't make it. No, I'll leave it. <laughs> I, can't, I can't do it. I'll start getting angry. Especially when other people are involved in it. Oh my God. I'm the most impatient. As you know, I'm so impatient. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm punctual usually. No, I'd say 99% of the time I'm punctual. I'm nah, never late. Nah, nah, nah. On. One time I was To the podcast. Come. Oh yeah, because... To yeah, the but, podcast. Yeah, but when 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 we say like a time like eleven, I'd that means Lawrence, eleven Lawrence. and twelve. Do you, in a, in a, who turns up to the podcast first? Most days. Come I on turn, now. I turn up second today. But but now come on now. I, me, I had one time when I didn't turn between up. Between me and Johnny, who turned? No 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 no. That's punctual. You're punctual, no, punctual no, ass, bro. no no no. The one time you didn't attend, that was because of that's the not min- punctuality. Yeah, exactly. That's because we didn't get so, told. So that was the one time you're yeah. talking about. Yes, you didn't eradicate that then. Yeah, you didn't attend. But I'm always here before you. Oh my days. Johnny, are you all right? But I used to drive and pick you up. No, okay, since then, who comes here first? Yeah, but your train's quicker. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck? That is the mo- Do you know we could get the same train? Yeah, but that's long for me though. Why would I get the train? <laughs> you know what I mean? We come from the same mean? but different ways. But I, I actually arrive here first. Do you? Yeah, all the time. Okay, but in general, you're usually late to everything. <laughs> yeah. I can't lie. To the podcast, I'm, I'm okay. Yeah, I'm but, yeah, but the podcast is relaxed though. When they say ten thirty, I know we mean like anywhere between that and eleven. That means you don't, just don't give a shit about their time. And <laughs> nah. Lawrence so is over. I was on time today. Lawrence is over there. I thinking, got here at ten thirty. Lawrence is over there thinking, what, what are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking I'm here, about? I'm here on the dot. <laughs> when, I ten, when I say when I say ten thirty, I fucking mean ten thirty. Oh, did you? Oh, I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> the podcast is laid back. Isn't it? <laughs> laid back. <laughs> <laughs> I spent two hours setting this up. Two hours in fucking, I spent two hours in there <laughs> taking down sets, putting sets. I've got two more to shoot after this, and you're talking about us oh, laid back. <laughs> <laughs> but no, I'm impatient though. Yeah, I'm a bit impatient. I think you do. I think you might do bad moving countries. <laughs> What's that got to do? With Should it? I tell you why? No, I'm genuinely. <laughs> it sounds random, but service in different countries is way worse. Yeah, but when I'm here. in country, other countries, I'm more relaxed myself. But if you used to move it's London, there, if uh, it's, it is the it me is and I was just talking before, um, I think London is up there in the top ten most fast. Cities. Yeah, fast pace. Yeah, no, hundred percent. The way we talk is very rapid. Yeah, or the way we walk. Like if you're in London, you're walking fast pace. You cram you your day. Mm. I hear it. Don't donkey punch him. I'm like, it's true. That's definitely true. You know, like when you go on holiday, you see the difference. More like. Everyone's just a bit more, you get me? Walking like that, innit? Go Spain, get, get a flipping siesta in and that midday. Manchester's <laughs> got to be a bit slow, but where they talk, because I feel like Manny accent is the slowest accent is in the UK. That? Like, I don't really know what I'm trying to do. Do you want to go over there? Like, I'm, trying speed up. About, I'm trying to think about my time in Manchester. I'm thinking. Like, usually we fair, talk I, haven't, fast. I haven't been in Manny. Nah, bro, nah, nah, nah. It's slower than London, but slower. it ain't. I think it's quite slow. I think London's just way it too just fast. just talk more relaxed like that. Um, I don't really know. Maybe I'm trying to go to the shop. It's like, I'll read the fuck <laughs> up, mate. I feel they like just well, do that. Yeah. Me personally, every man, any person from Manchester that I've like, met. Like, they might strong. just have less to do with their day. They just no, seem we, more no, chilled. But we, do you know what it is? You, we don't clock it that much, how, how hard or how vigorous shit is in London because we've been in it. Yeah. Like, I've been in it from the jump. Yeah. Genuinely, it's fast, bro. It's bare like, fast. And it's busy. Everyone's impatient. It's ev- fact. But this is what I'm saying. You take yourself out of it. Like, for example. Yeah. I don't know. Where I like, I used to love to go to Cyprus, yeah? Mm. I feel like you struggle there. Thinking like a service. I'm talking any service, bro. In, in a shop. In a restaurant. Yeah, so if I'm everything. like that. It's like, all I can't slow hard in here. Like if, if, yeah, yeah, yeah. They've got to be, in London, everything's got to be mad fast, including the services. Like, I went to, it does my night in like, fucking... I uh, went to when I went to Ibiza recently. Went to some little bar before. Um, it wasn't even a bar; it was like a, just like a little restaurant thing. Ordered me a drink. Ordered s- someone I was with a drink. Fucking uh, brought my drink over. He's taking long to do my, uh, hers. Yeah, whatever. It's taking ages. Taking ages. Taking. It's, it's probably literally only about five minutes. But like, I've got my drink. I'm watching the geezer. 
I've complained to the geezer four times because I'm thinking, where I can't relax and enjoy myself because the I drink ain't come. But where's this fucking drink? It's a Facts. drink. Facts. How long does it take to pour a drink? Yeah. So then I'm saying to him, brother, like I've ordered a drink ages ago. Like, what's going on? Okay, two minutes, two minutes. Goes back two minutes later. Brother, where's the drink? Like, I'm gonna not pay for it in a minute. Like, I'm so impatient when they're really truly, they're, they're probably thinking it's been like five minutes, mate. Calm down. But like but mine's for me, here. For, mine's here. For me. And mine's a cocktail. <laughs> That's a normal drink. You can't pour that. Like, fuck me, bro. What are you doing? <laughs> for me, five minutes Fucking is a long time. aggravating. I won't, I, like, I, I can't, whatever they're saying to me, the person I'm with, I can't you even, can't like, even lock in, just, I like... can't stop focusing on, them. where's this drink, bro? Are you an imbecile? Facts. Like, Same. fuck, it's getting me riled up now. <laughs> my dad, my dad has made me like that. I've told it before on the pod, my dad before, but not before, this is just him. When me and Joe, my brother, would be getting ready to go somewhere, so, say my mom and dad was going away for the weekend. Yeah. Or whatever. Say we're going out for a meal or whatever. I don't know what it is. Mm. He don't do that much anymore because obviously we've got our own cars. But when we were younger and our only way of transport was there, mm. then he'd wait outside the house with my mum in the car. John, Joe, come on. you got two minutes. Obviously, we're still getting ready in that. Beep, 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 beep. He'd then drive off. he travel. Not come back. <laughs> he'd go to the thing without us. And I'd ring my mum and me and Joe would be like, if we're younger as well, I'd be like, Joe be like crying and stuff like, why have you gone with us? I mean, we wanted to go there. My dad went, wait, you take too long. <laughs> You're fucking Wait, 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 wait. On wait, the wait, odd occasion wait, wait. when my mum would make him feel guilty, he'd come back, but he'd go mad at us when he'd come <laughs> back. Like, I, I ain't turned around. No, he <laughs> fucked it. I ain't turned around. Wait, wait, let me ask you something. Has he ever gone and, you, and, and <laughs> just gone? Like say for yeah, example- Yeah, not a better time. Yeah. You go on your little getaway with your family around there. Have, has it been like one of them times where you're trying to go? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that he, was what I was getting at. That, and is, he, that is the main thing. Okay, yeah. cool. And does he yeah. does he just leave? Yeah. And does he? And is there times when he doesn't come back? He don't come There's back. There's been times when he doesn't come back. Yeah. Because <laughs> he has to prove his point. Because like, if we call his bluff, we know he's gonna come back. <laughs> he's the best. <laughs> so dumb. You got you got packed, ready. Your cat, you're buzzing to go. Yeah, yeah. You're buzzing to go. Yeah. And he's driven off. Now you know you're. You just ain't going. Yeah, a few times. That's why I'm so impatient. Like I me and Joe, me and Joe are exactly the same. Yeah, whoever say we're getting ready to go out. I, I no joke. I can get ready for a night out in 15 minutes. That's all yeah. I need. That's all I need. I'm rapid. I'm not even trying to be rapid. I eat my food quick. I get ready quick. When me and Joe get ready in the house, we're about to go out with our pals, whatever. Fucking whoever is ready first. I, we say it's me who's ready first. If he's just coming and say, I'll go straight downstairs to by the front door, grab the keys, open the door. I'll be in the car. And then I get in the car. One minute, I'm ringing him. Where are you, bruv? Hurry the fuck up. All right, calm down. I'm just doing this. That's like, not, you I, got, I, I you can't wait. Straight Once I'm that. ready, that's why I always say, if I'm on holiday, like with you or anyone, get in the shower first. Oh, yeah, I you want do. you to be ready first because no, no. I know I'm going to be quicker <laughs> John, than you. Johnny will be like, you're going to get in the shower. That's why I get in the shower first, then I'm you. sitting there ready, bro. Yeah, you're gonna start getting like, ready. I'm all cleaning that and I'm sweating my fucking bollocks off because it's red hot. And I've just put this. You ain't lying still, you actually do that. That's the thing. You just sit there pacing about the room, bro. <laughs> thinking what to do with myself, bro. Yeah, does. I'm thinking in my How head. How can I'm you thinking... relax, bro? <laughs> I'm thinking in my head now. That... Is that why you do it, yeah? Yeah. Some of my mates, even my, my mate, my mate Frankie, bro. Mate, that geezer, I don't have to take long to get ready. Oh my god. <laughs> bro. Like, we'd be, there'd be an event that starts at like two, yeah? We'd be like, what time are you trying to get there, Frank? We'd be like, don't know, I might pull up at like eight. Ah? Uh -huh. Swear down. He was like, I ain't getting there first, bruv. <laughs> you could get there last. <laughs> I know, an event <laughs> finishes like 12. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, yeah, I ain't going with you then. Might pull up like eight. And he or like, or like, does go, he? Or like, or like, it'll go, yeah, no, he does it. Or like, it'll go through like his wardrobe and like take something out and then I like, just stretch and stand there and start talking about <laughs> something. And then just like, I'll be like, bruv, hurry the fuck up. What are you doing? He's like, oh, I don't know, man. Like, just stretching and just chilling and that. Like, and then he'll sit down and forget that he was getting ready and start talking to me. You know what I mean? Them ones. He's like me. Yeah. That's what I do. But, yeah. but bro, I think it's a mental thing, bro. It's maybe an autistic thing. No, it's not. It should be a God, fucking idol. Be an idol. Yeah, yeah, it should be an idol. <laughs> Well, look, back to the main topic. Back to the phone thing. Back to the phone thing. Because after Johnny just slagged off well, his could, pops, could, his <laughs> pops and his bread. Could, uh, could you? Could you um, live without, could I you could. Live, you could. I, I think it's healthy for the brain. But you know what? No, I could. I'll tell you why. Can I have other technology? Like what? My studio. Well, yeah. I need that. No Wi-Fi though on the, on the, on the, on the iPad. Dead. Can't do it. Can't do it. Need Why? beats, need... No, but if you had the beats already pre-saved. Yeah, I'll do it. 
Mm. Yeah, I'd do it. I would love to do like a little retreat in Iceland or something and leave my phone fucking. Bro, do you know what? No, but this is what I want to do, yeah? I'd want to. Where's do... Josh at the minute? He is in a getaway remote, little little remote place. I think it's in Sweden. Sweden, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and yeah, it looks sick, innit? It's like yeah. one of them. Okay, cool. So just to put it into perspective, it's one, one of our it. friends, Josh, right? So Josh Jones. This, beta squad yeah, Beta Squad cameraman. Lovely guy, unbelievable. If you haven't uh, seen his work, go and check it out. He's he's really good. Really, really good. But yeah, um, it's like a little house, little wooden house yeah, in the woods, in the middle of nowhere. In the middle of nowhere. Little lake when you look out, um, two Detox. story. It's, like, it's, it's nice, it's just cozy. You know what I mean? Kind of thing where you go outside, have a fire, like set up a mm, fire in that. Yeah. Make s'mores in that, marshmallows. It's It's like that. So I wanted I wanted to do something like a writing camp here, yeah? in somewhere like that. Go over there and write songs. That's live, oh no phones. Yeah, no phones. Well, like just flip phones for, for yeah, just flip for phones for, for for calling. Yeah, that's it. That was when life was. That was when that's life. Parker, bro, that's... What was I watching the other day? I was watching Police Interceptors. Yeah, or Twenty Five Thousand Police. I can't remember what it was, but it was based in. It was twenty ten. And like, just everything looks so much more calm and chilled and like, yeah, they got phones, but they ain't got like phones. phones yeah. You know what I mean? Not everyone's like, oh, I need to be like this person. Oh, I need mm. to look like this. Oh, let me sell my minge for five pound a month. You know what I mean? <laughs> it, it was it was very like chilled. Life was, and it reminded me of like 2009, 2008 days. That's actually old school. People don't realize that's actually old that's school. That's old bro. school for real. Like, but for us, it don't really feel like yeah, it. Don't. But that was, that was, that was, a, that, anything pre-2015, bro, was fucking. Yeah, unreal. I was no, no. Look, I very think, like. When was the last good year for you? <laughs> that's a depressing comment. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean. No, nah, but it, you know what I mean? You before, mean nostalgic before, year? Before, yeah, yeah, before shit flipped. 2018. Same. I'd say 2018. Okay. I think I lockdown, like, no, let me 2020 it made everyone go fucking. No, it's different now. It's different now. So, oh, yeah, so, social, social media, media mad. Over. But me, I think 2016 peaked for me. 2018 was the 2016 last. 2016 was good, yeah. I was there year. yesterday, you know, Stotley Park Golf Club. Is it? Yeah, I was there yesterday. Oh, it reminded me, sick. that's where we fucking- uh, Yeah, yeah, literally, yeah. literally. So that that's for me, 2016 was my peak. And then 2018 was the best, was the last, the best of the last. Good years, I reckon. I don't think good years. I've had some fucking sick years recently, bro. I, I just, lie. I just, I've had I think it's been different years, since then, bro. No, no, the whole vibe of everything. That's is what different. I mean. Yeah, I uh, yeah, like I agree. I agree. Especially this country, just... country, like everyone hates each other. Yeah, bro, it's gone. Le it went left after. Yeah. I say after twenty eighteen, it went left. Yeah, something, yeah, yeah. twenty nineteen was alright. Something happened. PTSD come out. Yeah, but it's love. I paid a price. Yeah, that was a good year. I was relate my good years to music. Twenty twenty shit. No, no, PTSD was twenty eighteen, but I listened to twenty nineteen. So it's P it was twenty twenty start of COVID, right? Twenty twenty was an awful year. That was when COVID started, right? Yeah, that was an awful year. Yeah, that twenty March twenty twenty. When did we go into lockdown? Was March, because I went I went Dominican for my ex's birthday, and then her birthday was February eighteenth, I think. And then um, yeah, we come back and we went straight into lockdown. Shit. And then that's when she left me. <laughs> I had to fucking put that yeah. in there, didn't it? Yeah. So and that's what she left. It was a good year for me. That's what she left. Thought about kicking the bucket many times. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking. I actually yeah. remember, now I remember it. Do you know what? Me and Johnny used to sit on the phone for fucking hours. Yeah, man. Oh it's my mad. God, that was a horrible time, innit? Yeah. No, but it's, in a way, now I look back on it, thank fuck it happened. No, no, now. Yeah, yeah, yeah but it. in the moment, yeah, yeah. Oh, the yeah. moment was devastating, bro. Yeah. And it was spread all to do apart from just going yeah. PlayStation. Yeah, man. Uh, yeah, I was I was itching to go for a walk all the time. I, I but I've walked off my area because of lockdown, and now lockdown. I love walking. I still go on walks now. I'm good habit that you picked up though. Hundred percent. I think my 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 only habit was playing Call of Duty. Yeah, like what, what annoys me? Same about the phone again. I feel like I'm very healthy off my phone. Like Casey's the same. Yeah, so is Joe. Like if we go on a walk or something, and then I go on a walk with someone who's my pal, but that like. You're not in my family, so like you, you don't do the exact same things that I do. Like me, Casey, and Joe, we go on a walk all the time. Don't go on the phone, put it on D and D. Yeah. Like if so, I'm on a walk and someone's on their phone as they're walking, and it pisses me off. You like, you're not be, in life. You just want to be. You're not you in life. Disconnect. You want to be in life. Yeah. Stop looking at your fucking screen, bruv. Wait, does that have, so so Casey and Joe don't do that, yeah? No. But when you go to other people, they do. Yeah. Fuck it, oh Johnny, bruv. It's jarring though. That's for you, isn't it? Yeah, it's jarring. Though, but that, they will just bother me that they're on their phone. Don't know, maybe I got problems. Johnny's got issues. I'm not even gonna. Do you not help me get off my phone? What? Locked in. 
See, when I was in there for two weeks, no phone. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Swear to God. When I come out, I was looking at my phone. It was like... I remember you told me this. You was bare like back just thinking of it. Shit. Like. <laughs> like, the, like, we think that's good HD quality, but where my eyes had just seen real life for two mm. weeks, mm. this was like, it was like weird. I remember you told me, I, I swear you said when you come out, you didn't go, you didn't, you checked your phone, obviously, whatever. But barely. Not, but barely looked at it. My yeah. mind was so much healthier. Did you think about it at all when you went in there? First couple of days. You was like, oh, I want some windows popping. Yeah, but then I was like, I wasn't really worried about running my socials or shit like that because one, Casey was running them and he's done a shit job to be fair, I'll be real. And then, <laughs> and then um, two, uh, I don't re I'm on camera and Foot Asylum are looking after me. So it's like, I'm being productive in here. Yeah, facts. You're, I'm working. You're, not, you're, you're, you're at work, you're at work. So I didn't feel that deep, but. Yeah, you was, in, you was, you was, you was in work, literally. Yeah. But I think the whole, see that, that's a, that would be the first time you spent two weeks off a phone since. Yeah. Forever, bro. Yeah. Forever. Since they come out. Just in general, no technology. Cause it's not even a thing of just a phone. It's just no tech. Oh, would you go back to Blackberry days? I would. Yep. Maybe not flip phone, but Blackberry. Little BB BBM. days, 100%. BBM. Woo! That was the days, bro. What? Send a broadcast with your brethren. Uh, Add my boy, six five. Well, if you don't like him, you only send it please. to them. Yeah. Yeah, you know about that. I'm my boy, six good five, footballer, plays ball, girls, girls good looking. Get at him. <laughs> yeah. B B two nine eight B one six or something. Oh, what was my pin? Oh, you weren't mad to remember your pin. Nah, bro. It's for Ween. Two two something. I remember it ended in B. It started with two and nah, then. Nah, I don't B. fucking remember. Did you have the eight? They had the eight three fifty. Was it eight? That was a curve. The cut had the curve. So then after and uh, so no, man, then at the back and they just had um Rubber bands around the batteries. Around the back to keep it. Because the, the, the back You had a snake and brick breaker. And then, and then look, if your battery come out, yeah, when you snap that back in, that loading screen is fucking long, do you Yeah. So put it back in, it, you oh, say battery yeah. is loading, it takes yeah. fucking forever. Yeah. <laughs> Damn ones. Come and then I upgraded way. to the bold. <laughs> now Did the bold shit, I didn't read nah, the bold. Nah, 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 the bold. The curve was the classic. Nah, nah, look, if you was a bold, brother. Nah, if you was a bold, you thought bro, you was got, better, but you're I got not. a picture on Facebook of me holding my bold like this. With <laughs> <laughs> me and my brethren. Blackberry man. I'm going to the bowl. Don't, don't say I bought it though. I stole it. Can't lie, can't lie. <laughs> Did you? But admit it now. What? Someone's Blackberry got taken. It's From school. where? School. Oh, you just sucked to a home one. But I was poor as fuck. What? You just done it on the sly or you done it to them? No, I done it on the sly. I couldn't do it to them. <laughs> He's teethed so I didn't fucking... have it like that. I didn't. <laughs> I weren't brave like that. But let, <laughs> let me not lie. I had to sure, joke someone's in school. Bold. I had to joke in school, bro, to survive. Sometimes I didn't get lunch money. Fuck it, they weren't they weren't missing it. <laughs> so genuinely, I feel like I want to go and bless everyone's pockets right now that I did. <laughs> I did stop. So you, you just you just bro, Oliver I was horrible, Twist. Bro. I was He's horrible. an awful dodger. Yeah, that nah, was bad. Me and my cousin. I remember to fucking keep my stuff on me, bro. <laughs> no, no, but bro, <laughs> it was it genuinely it was seriously bad. Like I took a lot of stuff, bro. It's like me and Tesco. There was one time. Let me tell you something. <laughs> <laughs> I even I'll, I'll say it now. Bro. I'm an older guy now, bro. I would never do this. Obviously, I'm I'm never. Mum's life. It's yeah, you can't talk off. Right, but as a kid, genuinely, I was so poor, yeah, and I wanted stuff. Like I really, really wanted stuff all the time. I remember this. This kid probably might see this. I can't lie. And hit me up, but <laughs> brother, we'll bless it out in it. Get him a black rear. <laughs> I know who quid. he is. He knows who I am as well. But thirty quid. One time, this brother came in with a fresh iPod Touch, bro. You know when the iPhone touches came out, it was the ones that first looked like the yeah, iPhone Yeah, I had one, yeah. With a little oh, silver touch. back. With a silver back. Nah, not, no, yeah, not the iPod. Not the Nano. Not nano. the Nano, bro, the touch. Remember the Nano? Yeah. So the, so the touch, Yeah, though, I remember the touch, yeah. Looked like a, it looked like an iPhone 4, but yeah, in the middle. Yeah, I had zombie farm on it. Slim as fuck. Wicked. There what you go. a game. Okay, <laughs> that's it. Bro, I say he's the only one in school to have one. There was, there was two people that had one in school. He was in a year below me, and there was one guy in my year that had it. So obviously I had taken... Where, how did you take it? I'm gonna tell you right now. It was, it was, it was too good. I, I, so first of all, I had to take a teacher's set of keys. Right? Oh, there was a plan to it. it yeah, yeah, just yeah. A... yeah, yeah, no, no. I took, I took the teacher's set of keys. Keys went missing. I had that for a long while. There's a bear other stories connected to them to keys, but let me just go with this <clears> one for now, yeah? A lot of stuff was going on. Assemblies were happening. Oh, keys have gone missing. We've seen people go into classrooms, blah, blah, blah. Please return the keys, whatever. They were my keys. I had them. <laughs> I'd only give them to the man them if they needed it. But <laughs> That's a pattern. That was it. That's a so risky boom. business though. Risky though. So look, 
obviously you have form classes. You got yeah. form classes yeah, in. True. Yeah. So boom, it's assembly time. <laughs> now, it was summer. Most of the people were leaving their stuff, their blazers and that in the form rooms, mm. going to assembly. I ain't going to assembly. <laughs> I've got the keys. I've gone to his form room. Open Took the him out of the pocket. I'm looking at classroom full of blazers and bags, brother. <laughs> I could hit the belly if I wanted to. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I could take everything. But I had my eye on that one thing, bro. That eye for touch. Slint. Mental. Bro, he had a purple bag. So it always used to stand out which <laughs> where he's sitting. Found his purple bag. Slipped into his blazer. Apple right there. Was there. Said, Come on. Straight in the pocket. Took that home. No charger. No charger. I sorted that out myself. What did I sort out myself? But listen, listen to this now. This is where it went left. Obviously, that thing there, I'm, it was probably very expensive at the time. I don't know how much it probably would have cost. But hun, like high hundreds. It's got to be reckon, like 300 quid, top, isn't it? Back then. I don't know. Because... Think about it. Yeah, and to be fair, thought, you know, TVs used to be like 1,500 quid. Right. Now they're like three bills. They're like three bills now. So think about when they just dropped, bro. That's This is like new gen shit, bro. No, no one, one has Google this shit. Quickly. How much did they used to cost? I need to know that because I need to know how much I took off him, man. A poor, poor brother. I feel bad. iPod Touch, fourth generation or something like that. That's what it was. How much did the original iPod Touch cost? No, 300 pound. I was right. Really? Yeah. It's like 700 quid now, isn't it? 600 quid. Oh, you can pick one up for 20 quid now. <laughs> I bet that is slow as anything. These little things, look. <laughs> yeah, I know you mean. Yeah. So, so, so here's a bad thing now. This is where it went left. He's obviously now reported this thing stolen and the police have got involved. Now you're shitting yourself. Now I'm shitting myself. So look, I've been called into the office. Why? Because I was walking around with the iPod, I can't lie. <laughs> <laughs> In school, but I was buzzing to have it. I just had to. No, nah, that's mine. It. Nah, it's mine. That's mine. <laughs> brother, brother even came up to me and said, I know you took it. I said, That's mine, bro. I've had that. I bought this two days ago. I'm out here flexing, flexing with the iPod. So they've brought me into the office now and they've said, Yeah, so look, there's a teacher, Miss, I'm not even gonna say her name, head of, it's head of year and a police officer, community police officers in the, in the room with me. Oh, so we know that you've got an iPod now, blah, blah, blah. And they, you say it's yours, yeah, blah, blah, blah. I said, yep, it's mine. I was like, okay, no problem. Just to make, just to to, to smooth things out, um, we're going to need you to provide the serial number for your iPod. And then he can provide a serial number for his iPod. If they match, that's his iPod. If they don't, no problem. We know it's yours. So then I've got the fucking thing in my sock here, brother. Because when they called me into the office, I thought, no way, bro. Put it in my sock here. What, a serial number? No, the actual iPod. Oh. I put it in my sock. As I've gone into the office, they're like, oh, um, we just need the iPod from you so we can get the serial number. It's, it's, it's engraved on the back, bro. Yeah, I know. I yeah, what? it's engraved on the back. I'm like, oh, don't have it with me right now. Don't have it with me. He's like, oh, so go and get it and bring it right back. I said, all right, cool. Do you know what I did? I walked out of school. <laughs> <laughs> you just cut. <laughs> Got up and I walked out of school. Boy, it's his, isn't it? So I, I'm not getting caught doing yeah, this. Yeah. I've walked out of school. I've gone home, yeah? And I'm thinking, what am I going to do? Bro, I'm about 12 years old. 12, 13 years old. How far is your school from your yard? About 10 minutes. Mm. So I've walked home from school and I'm sitting there, I'm thinking, shit, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? Yeah. Remember that there's a brother in my school with, in my year, iPod. with the exact same iPod. I've bailed him up. I said, <laughs> bro, I need to borrow your iPod. You know the deal. Like, I told him the whole story. He's like, can't get it, whatever. No. Oh my God, <laughs> you can I came, I swapped it with him and I've brought it in. I'll be like, yeah, here's my one. Read the serial number off. Two different serial numbers. Oh my days. Gave it back to my man. Took oh my, my God. <laughs> He's the liquor. <laughs> bro, Fuck me, but bro. I feel horrible now. You are my man free bills. I own free bills and I, <laughs> hit me up, brother. I sure is. <laughs> I feel so bad, bro, thinking about it. Like. You done the mad thing. I was that. It weren't no slight of van stuff. Like you planned No, no, that, no. Bro. I had to plan it. What was next? The bank robbery. <laughs> <laughs> there was a little. Nah, do you know what? Forget that. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. What, bro, what? There was a little. Oh, bro. Basically, me, me and my cousin, there was a little hole that we used to dig by a fence in the school. And there's just phones buried in there. Oh, you just used put to phones just, in plastic bags and just bury them there, bro. We needed bread, bro. <laughs> nah, the family, was, phones. The family <laughs> was just so poor, bro. Fucking so hell. poor. I just felt it like it started off as the you know you know the normal hustle, bro. Jawbreakers buy before yeah, school. Yeah, yeah. I used to sell, sell one for a pound and that. We oh, order a merge. Merge used to be fifteen p. Yeah, there you go, and then you can yeah. shut them out for more. Well, like, do you remember them um, 
them lollipops with bubble gum in the middle and it's really yeah. sour. Yeah. It was 20p in my shop. I used to sell for a You can go shop for like a pound. Cool now my nephew sells vapes. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Mental. It's a it? whole different thing now. Mental, bruv. Now you get a crack. What, double the price for a crystal bar? You get me? Yeah, word. <laughs> Trust me. It's different. But yeah, I started on that and then it was just like, yeah, I need more. I got, I got, I fell in love with the game, bro. So <sighs> yeah, we used to just have plastic I bags with phones buried in, the, in, the, in a hole, bro. Who did and you shot them to? People outside of school. Mad. Say for example, someone in a BB, bro, I'd shot it for the low. Yeah. Someone broke their thing, I'd sell it. Like, bro, I'll give it to you for a bill. Yeah. These are these are more expensive, but the phones are more expensive, but I'm giving it, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I needed it. So yeah, that, those are my ways, man. And I'm not gonna do it again, obviously. I've never done it <laughs> being older. No, I haven't. No, no, you can't. Have you have can't. That's <laughs> scummy, that is. It's scummy, bro. Like, like not scanning one of your items in a Tesco is sweet, but like Yeah, fucking... yeah, I'll be doing that. Yeah, I've been doing that. I've been doing lie. that. I'll just do it for the buzz. <laughs> Mum's like, a packet of peanuts or something, it's 30p. Like, where is it fuck for 80p? What did I make that one up for? It's you know I mean? more than that, but yeah. You know I mean? Yeah, no. I'd, Allegedly. I'd, I've done that. I'll be, I'll, I'll be it. Only from big companies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never from small business and that, whatever. Not. I pay my way. But mm. what I'm saying is. I never offer other people. <laughs> no, you don't. You don't. <laughs> I, if I'm the type of person, if I see a wallet on the floor, I generally will not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't take anything from it. No, no, no. I'd pick it up and look and try and see I'll if I can give it to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right now, nah. As a grown ass man, bro, if I saw someone's phone on the floor, wallet on the floor, bags, if whatever. If I see just cash, I'm taking it. Facts. Yeah, if it's just cash, yeah, it's on not the floor. attached to anything. And, I, nah, and listen, nah, and then nah. on top of that, it depends where though. And if the wallet is like. It is all mud on it. It's been there a minute, and you open it. It's behind some bins or something like that. And nah, you I open still, it. There's uh, five bills in there. I'm taking nah, five bills. I still return Cause, that. Cause, no, cause, because cause, look, what if you open a wallet and it, and you can see someone's like ID and that you know uh, it's someone? Yeah, true. I'd give it back. What but, if this is ID like fucking it's outdated by seven years or something? I'm still trying. I'll try first at least. In the old pounds. I'll try. If it was if it was loose cash, bro, I'll take it because. I don't know how I'm going to get that back to the original person, how I'm going to validate that it's theirs. But you see if there was like, even if it was like an old wallet messed up and it had yeah. peas in it, if I could find out it was, I'd give it a try. How about this? So you know my area is very calm. Yeah. Like it's, it's neighboring areas that ain't calm, but my little area is Yeah, like, yeah, your, your area is good. My little part, my road and it. So the other day, yeah. whole road got licked. What? Whoever didn't have their fucking uh, car, do car locked. No one really locks their car down my road. Yeah, because it's like smooth. It's, it's like dead end. Just dead end, yeah. It's sweet. Bruv, my car got licked. My you neighbor's car well? got licked. No, I usually do. But I, like, Joe was driving it and he fucking oh. just didn't. But bruv, the geezer are going around like 3, 4, and 1 and trying car, hand car doors. Took Joe's wallet, um, his, his card and his things. Joe had 2K cash. Thank God he took it out of the fucking thing, put it in his room. My neighbor's car got licked for stuff. Like, and it was all rummaged around. Um, like a couple of people got licked, just petty theft, didn't it? Nothing was smashed, yeah, yeah, nothing, nothing, yeah. but still like it could have been long. I would have loved to have found that geezer. And it's mad because the other day there was a geezer looking down my road and I didn't know who he was. And he was like Scoping looking outside it. my house and he's about 30. I was looking at him and I was with Casey and I was going to say to him like, you yeah, right, you're mate, right, mate, what are you looking for? Yeah. But he just walked off. And then my neighbor saw him when, when he, another day, someone I'm quite close with like, um, uh, he was like to him, uh, we we doing man here, mate? He was like, oh, I'm looking for John. Obviously not in relation to me, it's just a generic yeah, name. Yeah, yeah, just a name. He was like, no, John don't live around here, mate. And he was like, oh, all right. But he was like, proper having a little butchers and that. Get ready for freestyle. Like, here we go, freestyle. Freestyle's coming. It's off the dome, no no pre pre go pre, pre empty lyrics. Wait for it, sorry guys, it's coming. Three, two, one. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah. Hold on. I might shoot man down. Yeah, you end up in the gulag. What, <laughs> we're shooting on the camera. Uh, Michael's got a do rag. Uh, oh. And a do lag. <laughs> and a. Uh, uh, uh. And on. a do bang. New slang. Not a freestyle artist. I rap bar so. Can't par with a n like me. I'm a. <laughs> <laughs> Just in time. Okay, yeah, cool. What were you talking about? Uh, I love these yeah, ones. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Chawing out on the motor. So, what I'm going to do, I've planned already, yeah. What I'm going to do is I'm going to break up a load of glass. Yeah, put it in the fucking glove compartment and all the doors and that. Leave my car unlocked with nothing in there. So hopefully when he tries grabbing there, he'll cut his hand to pieces. Smart. Yeah. And then I want him to fucking hurt himself. Hopefully he cuts his fucking Smart. hand to pieces. 
Yeah. And it, it's but I want to catch problem. him because I'd love to go out there and belt him. Because he's obviously got nothing on him. He's just a little petty tramp, yeah, isn't he? He's a there, tramp, yeah, isn't he? Like, yeah. You're trawling stuff out of a car, you dirty little tramp, bruv. I'd love to catch him. Apparently he does it. it around like 3, 4 a.m. So wait up. Oi! He sprints up. I'd belt him. Do him up, man. Me and Joe just come out the house. Just, I'd you love to do him up. I'd oh. love to. I'd and love that to. neighborhood's so nice, bro. Like all the little, like, it's know, quiet. It's a nice, road, quiet road. Nice, yeah, your, yeah. Your, your road's proper nice. Like it's it's nice and tucked away. Yeah. You know what I mean? I'm I'm sure your neighbors are that really, you know, all, everyone's all pleasant and that. Yeah. Deeper. That's happened yeah. to that's happened when I was. What a um, tramp, bro. You going, but then again, more for us for not locking the thing. Do you know what I mean? My dad used Deeper. to go out and walk the dog and leave the front door open. See, that's do you know that's unheard of where I'm my, from? No, no, because my neighbors are so we're so like that. Yeah, yeah, no. Nah, you would. I know what you mean. It's communal vibes, community vibes. Yeah, like. Yeah, but I, yeah, if I lived on the high street, I wouldn't. Fact. It's just because my road is no. Yeah, yeah, no one comes down my road unless you live there. There's no need. There's no like, need. It's yeah, a dead end. It's a dead end road. Nothing's there unless you're coming to visit someone or you live there. Yeah, yeah. That's why it's, it's like that. See, we, yeah, me. At the chance, bro. At any chance, something, something's getting robbed. <laughs> <laughs> By you. <laughs> By me. <laughs> where, where was you the other night at three in the morning? <laughs> Brother, I was about, innit? Is that, is that not my brother's wallet? <laughs> I, got a new, oh, I got a new wallet. <laughs> yeah, then <them> was. <laughs> Johnny, look at me, pull up my wallet. Like, that. Like, hey, hold on a minute. Like. Why does it say JC in it? <laughs> it's a new brand, innit? <laughs> new brand. Why is it a JC scrubbed off? <laughs> oh, fuck, etched out that. Yeah, yeah the, the print, the Louis print. <laughs> Been airing Joe for the past <laughs> <one> week. <laughs> 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 I'm dead. And well, my dad said, he said, why don't you go over to the park and uh, look for your ID? Uh, go over the park? Yeah, he said, uh, he, he won't want that, will he? He probably slung it. But he took the wallet and the card. Joe was like, I'll buy him with 30 quid. He was like, waste of money, if you ask me. <laughs> 30 quid. Why you go over the park and look for your my ID? My dad's so like that. Like, <laughs> oh, he was like, wait, are you going out? I'm like, yeah, obviously most events are in East, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quite far. Even his podcast, I've said this before. You're fucking going away. <laughs> I, I, I just know I drive. You're mad. <laughs> Same with like spending money on anything. Yeah, he's a. He's like, bruv, I just, I've just done up my other room. Uh, you know the room? Yeah, opposite yeah, to Yeah, I've done it up to like, like an apartment upstairs now. Oh, six. And it? obviously, I want the telly, the satellite, to be plugged into the satellite in the fucking yeah. thing. So I've spoken this to my dad. I don't know how to do with that shit. Obviously, I want to pay someone to get someone in to do it properly. Yeah. Told my dad, do you know anyone? Get them in. So I've come home and uh, he's got a fucking. Don't tell me. Plastic aerial, that like antenna, stuck it to the wall with sellotape. It's good interior design. Yeah. Like a, it's like a black plastic sheet, like that big, yeah. And he just stuck it to the wall next to the telly and the wires all hanging. Sellotape's it. I come and he's sitting there on the TV. No, I have a good picture. <laughs> and I'm like, Dad, I'm not keeping it like that. That's temporary. Like, that, looks, that looks fucking terrible. Like, what sort of job is that? And he was like, it ain't cheap, you know. Cost me 25 quid. I thought, yeah, exactly. exactly. Fucking hell. Oh, it ain't cheap, you know. Got a pack of four for 25 he's the best quid. Guy, you know, he's the best. Off eBay. Just makeshift guy, bro. Just sellotape to the wall, bruv. <laughs> so bad. And you only walk in the room, yeah? As you're walking, the signal cuts out. <laughs> so bad. It's so bad. But he's chuffed with it. <laughs> he's he's over the moon. He's chuffed with it. <laughs> so what, you see him coming in, flicking through the Yeah, channel. yeah, he's watching telly on his own. And he's like, no, oh, for good picture. <laughs> <laughs> No, nah, bro, he's the best. Oh, mate. Jeez, I said, best. I want to drill through the wall and fucking connect it to the satellite. And then all... It will cost money, though, John. <laughs> oh, pay for it. Yeah, just get it done, bro. Get someone in. No. But he wouldn't pay for a new boiler. Oh, no, no, no. But he wouldn't pay for no, a new boiler. No, he wouldn't pay for a new boiler. No, no. I told you a lot about that. So, eh? Yeah, the so like I said, yeah, save monoxide. your life. Literally, you could save your life. We woke from... up in the night. The carbon monoxide alarms were going off, yeah? Um, and I rang my dad because my dad was away with my mum. I think I was on a cruise or something. And I was like, oh, dad, the fucking, the, the car, all the fire alarms in the house are going off. Obviously, there's no fire, no smoke, but the, the monoxide alarms are going off. He was like, oh, no. He, he, uh, he, he, what did he say? Oh, it's, just, <laughs> it's just a uh, yearly test. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a yearly yeah, test yeah, to yeah. test the grid. All the neighbours are having it. <laughs> That's it. And not next door. No, I didn't even knock next door <laughs> because she was asleep. Test the grid. All neighbours are like, all 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 having it. <laughs> so I thought, no, I don't trust this. I fucking, I've called um, oh, bro, called, called the gas people. I forgot what it's called. British gas or something. Geezer come over at like two in the morning. We're, me and Joe are standing <laughs> outside the house because obviously don't want to, there might be carbon monoxide in the yard. 
comes in, he checked the boiler, there's all soot on top of the boiler. He said, yeah, mate. He said, your house is full of carbon monoxide. He said, you need to cut the valve and get a new boiler. I rang my dad back up and said, oh, yeah, you, uh, you was wrong. It ain't a national test. Like, we're fucking, we've got carbon monoxide fucking all running through the house. He went, what, so you need to get a new boiler? You fucking idiot. He was like, you can pay for that then. <laughs> you fuck. Oh, yeah, we're so just So you're an die. idiot for discovering that you need <laughs> He would sit in the car with an oxygen. He was going to take day. the batteries out of the alarms. <laughs> Mate, he's anything to save a penny or anything to have someone over. He loves He's having. the fucking best. Do you ever said? Mark the shot. Oh, no, I don't know his name. Bleep, bleep his name. Bleep his name. God. <laughs> car with an oxygen just searing through the crib. All yeah. of his mates, the gnome and that, call him the shark. <laughs> take the batteries out of the alarms. I said, just get rid of the problems. <laughs> I don't want to see it. But he has, he, he, yeah, he just. Nah, he's the best. Bro. It's not as if he's skin either. It's just <laughs> he wants anything to save, to yeah, save a pound note. Save, save a pound note. Yeah, anything. Anything to save a pound note. But that will end, he'll end up with more fucking problems. That's what I he's understand. Bruv, he'll order a car or fucking whatever. Like, cause, cause that's what he does every now and then. Like he just buys cars, sells them for Sell more. Sell them off, yeah. But he's got the talk. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, he's a kill. Now, what a guy, bro. <laughs> Genuinely, what a man. <laughs> he even does it to his own daughters. <laughs> does he? Yeah, he bought my sister a car recently. And it fucking broke down the other day. There's nothing wrong with that. It's fucking brand new. <laughs> he knows damn well. No, he knows damn well. No, you got you got to move the clutch and gear. It won't go into gear one. You got to move it into gear. It's just got a knack. Everything he has has got a knack. It's got a little knack. But when he, when he sells it to people, he sells it to his mates as well. Ah, it's a very lovely, immaculate car. Clean car, clean, clean car. Anything he's got. I'm dying. <laughs> to his own brethren. Yeah. No, when fuck. he went to um, Turkey recently, he bought, a, not for himself, he got a load of fucking snide kettles. And, well, not a load, like three or four. Yeah. And uh, basically calling up his mates. I got a lovely, lovely <laughs> Rolex here. Uh, uh, literally perfect replica. I'm talking perfect. <laughs> Like immaculate. You won't, you won't tell the difference. Shows me it and I think, Dordy. <laughs> he's just so right. sad as And his mate, his mate wears it to the pub. Like, I've seen it on his wrist and I think that's so Jekyll. <laughs> it's I'm immaculate. Going. It's immaculate. What a lovely, lovely Rolex. <laughs> lovely, yeah. lovely Rolex, yeah. It's immaculate. You won't be able to tell the difference. <laughs> it's made in the same factory. <laughs> well, you bring yeah, it up. you got it off a looky looky man. Is it come in a box or anything or that? No, no, it was a proper thing. It was from Turkey, but still. Is still, it? like, but still, still a stuff. Jekyll kettle, bruv. Does it like what weight everything he the same? He tries to get me that? to wear them. He's like, oh, when you go out beef, I get the point, and he's like, when you go out beef, why don't you just get a fake version of your kettle? Yeah, yeah, because because then, but then they start. I bought the watch to wear it. To wear it. I couldn't be. I couldn't wear a fake watch. Yeah, yeah, I couldn't. Especially if you, especially if you get out for it right live on. A flight. Yeah, man. In beef, or someone comes up to you. Exactly, like, exactly. Let me see your kettle, bro. Yeah, no, no, I got the real one at home. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, all right, mate. Of course all right, you do. All right, mate. All right. Yeah. Yeah. But no, it's a smart thing to do because like celebrities do. Like Keith Lemon got robbed for his um. Patek or something, didn't he? Ages ago. Or was it Michael McIntyre? No. That was a fake one. He was on a fake Patek. But then you don't even question it because you think, well, he's a multi-millionaire. Of course yeah, he's, he's, got cool. a he's got a Patek. And if he didn't, got, he could get one. Yeah, maybe he's got to get to a point of established where people think Where people like, people, nah, people you know you're get up, to a point is like, bro, you know I'm up. Like, I'm doing this because... I fear for my shit getting yeah. robbed. That's it. But then again, it's like you don't buy it for. An, I don't buy my watches for an investment. I buy them to wear them. You want us to wear them? Want to put it on the foot like the bus? I can't lie. It depends where I'm going though. B yeah, no, no, no. Beef, I'd probably wear a fake day one. Day I can't I, lie. Yeah, day date, I would not wear anywhere in London. Like, okay, right. So that guy, would you would you step to a club? It, no, not with the day date. Rolling. No, with with one of my Rolexes, not with a day date. You just wouldn't too too much of a risk. Yeah. There you go. It's just draw a target in you. But if I was going to. The unless, I unless going, I went out with my mates and everyone had and a date date on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then yeah, everyone is vigilant. Out. Yeah. Everyone's, everyone's like, on point. what? Like, mm. you know what I mean? Whereas if it's just me, yeah. and like my, my mates still have kettles, but like... Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Well, then I there sh- we go. I think we hit 45. Yeah, we we'll, we'll, On that note. We'll end it there. What do you think? Do you think wearing a fake kettle uh, to replace a real one, if you've got the real one, is bad? Or could you do it? Me per- I, I hear it, but me personally, I couldn't. And could you live without your phone? Could you? Yeah. Let us know in the comments. You won't be able to watch us. That's true. <clears throat> Why did I wink and point? That was the cringiest thing. Cringe. Word. And so they shoot my Gavin. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. Jagas. Sweet. We'll see you next week. Bye.